Blue Dragon, White Tiger, Firebird, and Black Tortoise. The four powerful mystical beasts from the ancient legend, and reigning over them are the two supreme mystical beasts, Kylan and Phoenix. It's said that Phoenix is lying dormant somewhere here in Crestland. It's unfortunate for us as well as for Kylan and Phoenix that the four mystical beasts have yet to be collected. In good time, Agent Dark. It will all be dealt with soon. Grand Bee Master! What's up, yo? Genta, I need you to do something as the acting North Area Bee Master. Roger. So, what's the job? Defeat the South and East Area Bee Masters. Uh. Whoa, hold up a sec. You sure about that? You are to become the Bee Master of all areas. <laughs> Here we go! Where's your head at? Huh? Your aim's all over the place. If you were concentrating at all, you wouldn't be playing like a total amateur. <sighs> Relax, you don't have to get so mad. Sorry, I don't like wasting my time. He's not half the player he was before. He's lost his focus and his drive. <laughs> but it's only natural. His mind is gonna wander a little bit, right? He only just decided to come over to our side. <laughs> Whatever. I've got better things to do than battle someone who's not even trying. Ah! What's his problem? What a derp. The dude was in the same position when his friends betrayed him. He had like, you know, major doubts and stuff. Maybe that's why Ken's upset. Bakuga reminds him of how he felt back then. You mean, you know what it's like to have your peeps betray you? Oh, uh, well, no, not exactly. Because I think I was actually the one who did the betraying. Come back later. Happy birthday, young master. We hope you like your presents. Young master, I have a son about your age. I think you two would get along. I should introduce you to my daughter. After my father was arrested and accused of crimes he didn't commit, his name was dragged through the mud. All the people who claimed to have been our friends stopped coming around anymore. Except... What do you call it when it rains chickens and ducks? Mm -hmm. Foul weather! Huh? Seriously, bro? Not even a little smile? <laughs> Genta. Got it! So this guy, your friend, he's the one who defeated you? The North Area Bee Master? Genta Kokuchi, am I right? I feel like after all he and I have been through together, that I'm turning my back on him. Hold on. Your choice had absolutely nothing to do with any of that stuff. You joined all of us because you thought it was the right thing to do. You just wanted to leave your old life with the Grand Bee Master. So it's all good. <laughs> Win ten more games and I'll be right back to zero. Uh, did he say ten more times? Yeah. Uh, I don't know how much more of this training I can take. Come on, you should have at least two hundred matches a day to stay in shape. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <gasps> two hundred? All right. <laughs> <laughs> 
100 to go. This is the perfect time to grab a little chow break. <laughs> I can't take any more of this. We must leave now, or we'll be here all day. Sounds good to me. <laughs> that Rido boy is quite a force to be reckoned with. <sighs> For sure. I mean, I'm happy he came to the East Area and all. But I just can't keep up with his intensity. Opponent located. Lock on target. Huh? Caught you napping. You don't look much like an East Area Bee Master. Who are you? I'm the North Area Bee Master, Genta Kokuji. Now battle me! Huh? Battle you? Why would I do that? Because the Grand Bee Master commanded it, bro. Really? What if I refuse? Well, then it's an automatic forfeit. And your title as East Area Bee Master will be given to me. So you're saying we have no choice? <sighs> it's quite dishonorable of you to challenge us when we're clearly both exhausted. Yar, huh? News to me. I just thought that's how you roll here in the East! <laughs> <laughs> I'll just wait till you've rested. Until then... Hey! What are you doing? If you're tired, then I should be tired too. It goes against my personal code to battle a guy when things aren't totally fair. Uh... Riki, tell me. Do you think this is some sort of trick? Nuh-uh. I get the feeling that he's got nothing to hide. Uh-oh. That's the kind of opponent to fear the most. Let's do it, Tank Shell. Yes, sir. Bee shots! Ready, aim, fire blast! He's incredible! Look at that rapid fire! He's overpowering us. I'm on it! Storm Inferno! <sighs> What's wrong, Riki? He's scoring on us with ease. Are you still feeling tired? Yeah, but we can't worry about that now, can we? Here he comes again! <laughs> we can't compete with the speed of his rapid fire! I know! Let's go, Tidal Burst! Is that supposed to be a counterattack? <laughs> Whoa! You are saying? Nice! With those slick moves, I get how you became the East Area Bee Master. I guess I'd better step it up too, huh? Tank Shell! Roger that. This'll tip the scales. Stabilized! You thought we were fast before. Our enhanced super speed will have you crying in your cereal. <laughs> what was that weird energy? You felt it too? I sure did. It was like an extremely aggressive presence. Something most malevolent. Envelope charge! Infinite Dark Inferno! Blast through time eternal! Dashing tank show! Ah! Get ready for his special move! Ah! Double Emblem Charge! <laughs> Of my timing. My attack was a second too late. Ah! Drossian! You're hurt! Takeover of the East <sighs> Area. Affirmative. Mission accomplished. Bada bing, bada boom. From now on, you gotta obey the Grand Bee Master. Capiche? Hmm. <sighs> hmm. See ya. <sighs> what was that terrible feeling we both had during the match? Mystery. I have no idea, but... It was creepy. I guess there's a lot more to his beat him on than we realize. Huh? 
Huh? Having a road fight in a place like this? Not exactly, Chief. This is the south area, and what they're playing is... Oh, right, I forgot. So this is Crossfire, is it? Forgive me, but you seem intrigued. Uh, yeah, right. You gotta be kidding me. I mean, it's just a silly game. I'd never waste my time on something like that. At least, not until I've taken control of all four areas anyway. Mm -hmm. There. He's good as new. Are you okay, Drossian? Yes, I feel excellent. I'm completely repaired. Ha! What a major relief! I knew you could do it! <laughs> I'm amazed someone was able to damage him so badly. He's a pretty tough fighter. The North Area Bee Master, I mean. He really is. You know him? No, but Bakuga told me about him. Where is Bakuga, anyway? Oh. I forgot to tell you, he's off training with Hugo. Ah, Hugo? I sure hope he had a big lunch. Ah, and bomb charge! Imperial Thunderclaw! Claws of the Jungle King! Jet Leo! Ah! <gasps> <laughs> Would you get a load of this guy? He's a total beast. He gives it a hundo P every match. Snap out of it. This is no time to be spacing out on me. Whoa, he's actually countering Hugo's power shot. He does it by firing at the exact spot that maximizes his power. That's how good his control is. Looks like he's back on top of his game again. You're right. Now let's see if he can compete with Hugo's impressive power. Ah! It's time, Perfect Raedra! I was starting to think you'd never ask. Emblem Charge! Shining Combo Slash! Shatter the entire galaxy! Perfect Raedra! That's more like it! Oh yeah, he's back all right. That's the Bakuga who defeated me. Young master. <gasps> it's so great you're all fixed up. The North Area Bee Master? You serious? This is the guy. In the flesh, I'm Gentikokuji. I'm guessing you heard the deeds from the little guy over there, so I don't need to explain things. Come on and battle me! You're on, but I'm not just gonna stand by and let you take over my area! Let's beef it up! I'm on it, Chief! Dry Garuburn! Count them down, Ricky! Beat shots! Ready! Aim! Fire Blast! Ah! So this is the rapid firepower Riki told me about? Don't let his pace throw you off! Hey, are you listening? Huh? Oh, sorry, I totally wasn't. Seriously? No worries, I'm just messing with you. Come on, let's show this guy what we're made of. Are you actually enjoying this? If I can't battle someone tough enough to be worth my while, I can't get fired up! <laughs> let's do it, Garburn! Yeah! Quantum Drive! Go! Ha! Whoa! Nice one! Hey, why are you trying to take control of all the areas anyway? Why, you ask? Because I'm going to bring back the Grand Bee Master's road fight code, okay? To put things back to the way they were. But you've got to know that Bee Shots can't really enjoy beat em on with all those crazy rules. Wouldn't you rather just play the game to have fun? <laughs> Have fun? Beatamon's got nothing to do with fun. It's all about whether you can win or not. The Grand Bee Master believed in me because I can outthink and outplay my opponents and win! Since the day my papa gave me Tank Shell, I've been completely focused on Beatamon. That's how Bakuga and I got to know each other. Back then, everyone just did what they wanted. But then we met the Grand Bee Master. He took us under his wing, introduced us to the road fight code, 
and taught us the true intensity of battle. I didn't have much else going for me except the fact that I never lost a road fight match. That's when I was made the North Area Bee Master. The Grand Bee Master believed in me and encouraged me to become great, but Bakuga decided to throw away everything the Grand Bee Master gave us. He turned his back on me! You're wrong! Bakuga didn't betray you. He just did what he thought was right! Whatever! <laughs> One-handed move! <laughs> You gotta be kidding me! His rapid fire is blocking me out! Kaven, use the quantum drive again! Storm Inferno! Yeah! That's what I'm talking about! Genta, don't hold back your attack! Roger that, Tank Shell! I'll let it in one shot! Emblem charge! Storm Dark Inferno! Blast through Time Eternal! Dashing Tank Shell! What was that? I just said something. Oh no! That weird feeling again! What's wrong, Garu Burn? You good to go? Uh, yeah! I'm all fired up! Emblem Charge! Quantum Blast Drive! Light the blaze! Drive! Garu Burn! <laughs> opponent's finishing move struck the edge of the puck at the exact same time. It's spinning like crazy! <laughs> Where is it? What happened to the puck? It must have gone into the goal. My rapid fire wins again. No way! My drive shot definitely got me the point. But check out the scoreboard. They're still tied at one point each. Look at the center of the battle stage. Amazing. It's wedged in there. Seriously? How's that even like possible, bro? It must have been caused by the intensity of all that spinning. Hmm. The accompanying friction drilled it into the playing field. That was too cool! I've never seen a game end like that! Uh, oh yeah? Well, what about the match? We're not done our battle yet! It's a draw. With the playing field in its current condition, we'll have to suspend play indefinitely. What'd you say? No way! The round ends in a tie because your skills are so evenly matched. A tie? Reminds me of a little joke I heard. How'd the alien tie his shoes? With an astronaut. Uh... Um... <laughs> <laughs> oh well, seeing as how you laughed at my joke, guess we can leave it at that today. But I'll be back. I'm gonna take over all the areas for the Grand Bee Master for sure. All right, then I'll be waiting for you. And next time, you're going down. Hmm. I like the guy, even if he works for the Grand Bee Master. Oh, you must be getting delirious. You should get some rest. Uh, honestly though, his joke was pretty funny. Oh, I almost forgot. Cayman, did you feel anything weird while you were fighting him? Huh? What do you mean? I did. I felt something strange while he was launching a special move. Oh, really? I was too focused on the battle, I guess. His attacks were all legit. He wasn't a dirty player or anything. And to be honest, I had a blast. <laughs> That's really just like you. I felt the presence, but I'm confident there was no true malice in the boy, or in his fighting style for that matter. Then, I wonder what it was we sensed. Hmm. Here it is. Well now, they've certainly done their research on the supreme mystical beasts, haven't they? Uh-huh. Wait, is that true? How come we didn't know about this? <laughs>